Hello friends, it is a Costco shopping day here in Anchorage, Alaska, and I can hardly believe it, but I'm saying this, it's sunny today, and it has been for the last five days. We've just been enjoying every minute of it. Oh, it's like 64 degrees, but it's been in the 70s. It's what we've been waiting for all summer. We're actually headed to the cabin tomorrow, so I needed to get some Costco shopping done, and I'm gonna bring you along. Okay, I am wearing a boot. If you didn't see my previous video, I just kind of irritated an old injury and every time I just wore regular shoes, I would re-hurt it. So I am making myself wear a boot for a week so that it can feel better. So I'm about at the end of that week, but I'm gonna wear it today because this is a lot of walking, but I think we're getting, I think it's, I think it's getting back to normal. So hopefully I can go to the cabin without it, but you may see me hobbling around a little bit. I am fine, nothing is really wrong. I'm just trying to baby that ankle so that it doesn't hurt permanently. Okay, five days of sunshine and they've moved all the fans up to the front. Fun fact, you may not realize Alaskans don't have air conditioning. So if it gets a little bit hot, we struggle a little bit. So I'm sure they've been selling a lot of fans this week portable air conditioner and then the fancy Dyson air cool this one's $399 and this one's $39 okay first thing I'm grabbing Mark asked me to get some of his favorite pants for Hunter I'm hoping that the 3229s will work for him with a belt they were a little bit, he tried on marks, they were big on the waist and long, so these should be shorter, but I also hope that he can wear them. He needs them for an upcoming hunt that they're going on. And then grabbing some quart size freezer bags on sale for $13.59. We hope to be filling these quart size bags with lots of halibut at the cabin in the next few days. Ooh, this really pretty beverage dispenser is on clearance for $19.97. If I didn't already have two beverage dispensers, I would definitely consider buying this one. I think it's really pretty um, and simple. Holds two gallons. I always have Bennett make our favorite lemon water punch. I'll put the uh, recipe down in the description below. Super simple. We serve it whenever we're having more than just our family over. It feeds a crowd with just a little few ingredients. I'm not quite ready to wrap my mind around back to school even though it's two weeks away. I'm kind of waiting till after we get back from the cabin, but I am going to grab this Puma backpack for Bennett. He's gonna need a bigger backpack this year. He's starting middle school, $26.99. I am gonna also grab one of these each for Hunter and Bennett. These seem perfect for middle school. Elementary school, they have a lot more like specific things that they need, but I got this for Hunter last year and it was a good thing. So I guess I'm semi-ready to think about it, but not really. Holding on to summer for a little longer. Like never find a small size of men's stuff in um, Costco. So I'm gonna grab one of these shirts for Hunter. A woven camp shirt. He said he needed some shirts for his hunt. We're starting to get shirt jackets in. These Sherpa soft on the inside. It's a bit thicker than the one that I bought a couple years ago. They have a couple cute colors for $14.99. This doesn't happen very often, but when we are leaving on a trip, I do shop with a list, so you might see me referring to this list as I shop. Usually I just grab whatever I know we need to go with our moose meat and um, things at home, but this week I gotta be a little bit more specific. He does $4.99. Tortilla $6.29. $2.99 for three pounds of bananas. Gotta get some white bread for campfire pies. $6.99. And the apples, $8.99. A bag of limes, $5.99. This 
smell kind of off. Let me see if they have a better one. They look okay. Cabbage, $3.99 for two. $6.49. $7.99 for two. This is Bennett's request when I was leaving the house. Some muffins, $9.99 for two. I have not seen these before. Mini lemon cakes with buttercream icing, $8.99 for the six. Got some California peaches. Hmm, they don't have much smell to them. Sometimes I'm leery if they don't smell good. I can't smell any peach. What about the nectarines? I can't smell anything. These ones have some good smell to them, so $12.99. We got this lemon meringue cheesecake for uh, Everett's birthday. It was amazing, but now I see something new here. A peanut butter chocolate cream pie. It's huge. I feel like we need to try it to see how it is. The boys are celebrating their last night of mountain biking tonight. Maybe we'll have that after they go mountain biking. Peanut butter and graham cracker crust. Peanut butter cream baked in our own bakery. Chocolate cream. We'll try it for you guys and see how it is. I had a viewer ask this week, what is the price of halibut here in Alaska? I see some here. $19.99 a pound. So this piece right here is $76. You can also get the black cod for $8.99 a pound. So half the price of the halibut. Makes me want to go catch some of our own. $11.99. I think I'm going to grab two. I'm just afraid one day it will never come back, so I want to have some stocked up in the freezer. $8.99 for chicken tortilla soup. $7.99. $9.99. Mexican halado popsicle. I think this is mango. bread. So gotta go back. $5.99. Got lots of mattresses right now and a whole lot of rugs. Outdoor, indoor rugs. Definitely getting lots of home stuff right now. $16.99. Get us ready for back to school. $10.99. I don't know if I've ever bought these before, but I think I've had them before. I'm just gonna grab them. $10.99. They got a few different treats back here. Twisted frozen yogurt in little 18 mini tubs. $16.49. So interesting. What are the flavors? Ooh, Australian owned and made chocolate cookie watermelon mango and blueberry lemon cheesecake yum never seen those before and i've never seen these chip witch 12.69 for 10 sandwiches 7.59 we've been making lots of smoked salmon with cream cheese lately so yummy I'm gonna grab some of these for that 4.39 I've just been wanting a basic white shirt, so I'm gonna grab this one for $8.99. Also gonna grab this for Hunter, a performance hoodie. It's like a polyester material, so he, he can't really wear, you gotta avoid cotton when you're out hunting in the back country, you don't wanna get wet. So this might fit him, we'll see. If not, I can bring him back. $14.99. You know what, I'm gonna try these shirts. It's. $6.97 for three shirts. I always need basic shirts. They've got kind of a cute ribbing design. I'll try that. Oh, box of candy bars, flour tortillas, and trail mix. Mark also texted me a few things that he needs for the hunt, so I gotta make sure to grab those too. Four sixty-nine. 
tray your rub $14.99 Never seen these before. Probiotic strawberry yogis. $11.99 for 30 little bags. Don't know if those are any good or not. Haven't seen these for a long time. I love putting these in the boys' lunches. $11.99 for a bag. We haven't had them for a while. Got this for $25.99. And this for $28.59. I'm gonna buy both. They can take what they want. We'll use this for s'mores and just to have. I think we're pretty good. Oh, trail mix. $30.99. Oh, it's busy up front. I'll show you what's in my cart. Here's our cart for the day. You may notice I got a lot less vegetables. One, I just don't want them to go bad. Two, we're harvesting from our garden, so we'll do that when we get home. Harvest those vegetables and take them with us. Lettuce, broccoli, and they didn't have the bag salad that I wanted, so I just had to skip that. So, yes, a lot less vegetables today, but we do have veggies at home still. Once I slow down to stand in line, I feel worn out. I'm glad there's a big fan going. It feels nice and cool. This boot that I'm wearing, I feel like, heats me up. Ankles feeling fine, but I'm ready to get home. Glad I had some ice water in here. Let's get home, I'll share the haul and tell you the total. Hopefully the boys are home. They wanted to go to the park and the bike park and grandma said she would take them so they stayed with grandma. Um, hopefully they'll be home though to help me unload these groceries. No. Lots of helpers. Thank you, Bennett. Ooh. Miss Luna has come to check things out while I'm setting out the haul. How are you, sweetheart? Hi. All right, let's do the haul in case you missed something or I have missed showing you something while we were shopping. Got some Go-Gurts. I had stocked up on Go-Gurts when they were on sale and put them in the freezer. I think we left them too long. We put them back into the refrigerator and they were chunky. The boys have been not loving them. So just be aware, if you freeze them for too long, you need to eat them frozen. You can't let them thaw back out or they're just chunky. So, restocked on Go-Gurts today. Cream cheese, two things of bananas, and some apples and nectarines. Green cabbage, carrots. Tortilla soup, some sausage links. We ran out of Traeger seasoning. This is our favorite on moose steak, so grab that. Restocked on the honey, citron, and ginger tea to take with us to the cabin. We got some pitas for euros, French bread for French toast, cilantro lime dressing, and two bags of euro meat, two bags of 
bagels for breakfast and then we like to make campfire pies with white bread at the cabin with whatever fruit is in season or rhubarb so grab that tortillas mark asked for some trail mix a good road trip snack we can pick a pop we're all excited to try the peanut butter chocolate cream pie easy breakfast and some limes i'm hoping that after we catch some halibut we can make some ceviche so we got some limes for that and over here hunter tried on this shirt it looked pretty good he liked it he has the pants on he's looking for a belt and like the other shirt as well mark asked for candy bars and then we'll use some for s'mores and things like that candy bars are expensive these are for hunter and bennett this is also for bennett starting middle school and i'm excited to try these little ribbed shirts these are really hard to find so i grab them if they have them in stock I like to have those on hand chips were on sale so i grabbed a box of those we'll take a few to the cabin but also for when we start back to school in a few weeks and freezer bags we're just gonna take this whole thing down to the cabin to package up how but hopefully we'll get a good stock for the rest of the year and our total let's see i think i had the receipt in my pocket oh my no, yes and it wants to guess the total. $524. $524. All right. Thankfully, it wasn't that much. Today's total is $449.43. If you'd said $450, you would have been, you know, 57 cents off. All right. We're going to try that peanut butter pie after the boys do biking tonight. Uh, we'll let you know how it is before we finish out this video. Now I got to get all this stuff put away. Spectaluna. Yep, Luna's. Checking out the stuff on the table. Chicken. A lot of the stuff's just gonna go straight back into these bags because we're leaving in the morning. Mark and Hunter are Packing up all this stuff for their goat hunt. So we got 20 candy bars in here. Two candy bars a day times five days. <laughs> Might seem excessive, but it's a luxury. It's like so helpful. Up on the mountain. Keeps so, you going. All kinds of stuff. I'm getting ready to sweep. Okay, I'll see you over in the field. Okay, I'll see you over in the field. So today is the last day of the boys mountain biking club. They've been doing it for about a month and a half this summer. They loved it. I wasn't sure about it, but they love it. Two nights a week they come, they ride according to their age group in groups of six to 10. They're riding these trails, it's been so fun. So tonight, for this final night, they have a scavenger hunt where the kids have to lead riding around these trails to try and find as many stickers so they can for their little passports. Oh, Weston. Oh, this is easy peasy. Now they're following the map. Get those stickers for the stamps. What did you find? Any stickers? No, what about right here?
one fun thing about this is seeing how excited these kids are about being outdoors and seeing all this fun yeah, stuff. Stick oh wow, this is rough. We, oh, down. <laughs> down this one. Did you really? Beautiful here. Yes, yeah, beautiful. Yeah. This is a dangerous trail. Ah! I did this whole trail and it didn't switch gears. I did this whole trail and it didn't switch gears. Hunter, it's easier by 30 minutes. I bet. Yeah, See, they were 4.3 miles further than they ever did. Wait, how long? Did you tell your coach thank you? 4.3 every single sticker. We got the five. We got the backpack. We got second by 45 seconds. Yeah, popsicles for everybody. Or? Yeah, right there. I got. This is my fifth. You enjoy the program? Yeah, it's fun. It's epic. What an awesome program! It's been so fun watching these kids get better and. Tonight we rode four and a half miles with those younger kids, so. Have you had fun, Bennett? Yeah. Oh. <sighs> okay, the boys are home. We can't get them to come inside, but they're just having so much fun outside. Hanging out with their cousin. But I'm gonna try this peanut butter pie. I'm not really hungry, I'm just gonna try a bite. Mark, you wanna try this? Oh, Luna came. She thinks she's getting some peanut butter pie. So it's got graham cracker crust, then like a peanut butter mousse, chocolate. Let's try this. Okay, can I share your plate? Yeah. <laughs> what's, it, mm. what's it called? Peanut butter chocolate silk pie. Wow. It's so smooth and good. It's like a smooth, fluffy Reese's cup. Yeah. It's really tasty. Yum. I give it two I thumbs up. I think a little bit would go a long way. Yeah, a little too. bit is very, very yeah. strong. Yeah, it's strong and good. But, but yeah. yeah. I like how smooth the. Yeah, they did a good job with that. Yeah. If you like peanut butter, this is dangerous. I want one more little yeah. bit. I need some water. It's big too. Yeah, I know. Very big. It go a long ways. Feed a lot of people. I just need my water. We get the kids to come inside. It's almost ten o'clock out. It's almost ten o'clock at night, and it's still light out. They're playing in the yard. I think they'd like it. Not sure how we can get that to the cabin, but are we supposed to? I don't know. Um, yeah. Maybe we could freeze it. Yeah, I bet you could freeze I it. I bet we could freeze it. Probably be good if frozen. How about we come back? That sounds like a good idea. Yeah. Well, friends, thanks for coming shopping with me today, and biking with the boys. Yeah. Uh, that was a great activity for them this summer. They rode so hard every Tuesday <laughs> and Thursday and loved it. <sighs> We're off to the cabin tomorrow. Thanks for spending time with us. We are so grateful for each and every one of you. Oh, Luna's got the zoomies behind us. We'll see you again real soon for more of this Alaska life. Bye. I think there's a fly or something. She is like... Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's chasing something. <laughs>